Welcome to the second Frua KH technical instructional video. Today we'll be focusing on the unitized cartridge bearing. It is sealed, preset, and not adjustable or greasable. These are the tools required. Seal remover, hub puller, drill driver, hub nut socket, seal installation tool, torque multiplier, and tension wrench. First we remove the hub cap. Second we bend up the lock tabs. Then we remove the castellated nut. Remove the lock tab washer and the thrust washer. Next we'll be removing the hub. Now yeah, we'll move the hub. When removing the hub, help support the hub to avoid damaging the thread. Now we inspect the axle spindle using a clean rag. Clean the spindle thoroughly and the spindle threads. Inspect axle spindle surface and shoulder for any scratches, burrs or surface imperfections. If required, use emery paper to clean surface. When replacing bearing, always replace the lock tab washer. Inspect both the thrust washer and the nut surface for any wear. Replace if required. Also lubricate threads and refit nut, ensuring a nice free installation of the nut and that no high spots are found. Repair threads if required. When replacing the bearing, remove and replace the snap ring. When installing of the new bearing, press on the outer bearing cup, not on the inner bearing cone, as it may damage the bearing. Remove and replace the hub seal. After removing the hub, make sure the hub seal is replaced. Do not reuse the hub seal. Properly fill the cavity between the inboard seal and the bearing with a Castrol Serol EPLO type grease or equivalent to help lubricate the seal and for longer life. Apply a good film of anti-threat paste to the entire bore of the bearing and also the o-ring. Lightly grease the ID of the seal. Apply a good film of anti-threat paste to the bearing bore as well as the axle spindle. Now refit the hub, ensuring to help support the hub to avoid damaging of the thread. If the hub jams, remove and refit. Do not force the hub on if it jams. Fit the thrust washer and the new lock tab washer and the castellated nut. Apply a light film of grease 
onto the mudding surface. Now do up the hub nut while rotating the hub in both directions. Now torque the hub nut to 950 newton meters. Bend over a minimum of two lock tabs, opposite if possible. Inspect the O-ring, replace if damaged. Apply a light film of grease onto the O-ring. Now refit the hub cap. That's basically how you remove and refit the unitized hub and replace it in the bearing.